What's up, everybody? It's your boy, AC, and welcome to another edition of LA Sports Live. We have just completed the first Sunday of football. We still got Monday night football tomorrow, but uh, Sunday night is complete, and it was wrapped up, and it was uh, the LA Rams, I guess, coming out, I guess you could say with uh, somewhat of an upset victory, the Rams eked out a 20-17 to victory over the uh, Dallas Cowboys, and uh, that was... The opening game in their new stadium and the Rams were able to eke out a victory. Actually, the Rams actually had um, they had opportunities to score actually more points. A couple of times they had to settle for field goals and they actually missed one field goal. And uh, so that, you know, kind of made things a little bit tight going down to the end. Of course, if you watch the game, um, Dallas did have the ball towards the end of the game. They were driving. Uh, Dak uh, completed a long, I think it was somewhere about 30, 35 uh, some odd yards pass to Gallup, but he was flagged for the uh, uh, offensive interference, and that just pretty much killed that drive, and the Rams eke out a victory. Let's look at the uh, the, the stats for the Rams, and uh, there was there was one the one big surprising standout for the Rams was their defense. They held a powerhouse offense like. <clears throat> Excuse me, the Dallas Cowboys is 17 points. Let's look at the uh, let's look at the offensive uh, stats for the Cowboys. Um, of course, you know their quarterback Dak Prescott. He completed 25 of 39 attempts for 266 yards, one uh, one touchdown. And um, <clears throat> in the backfield, they had of course Ezekiel Elliott leading them with 22. Uh, attempts to 96 yards and one touchdown um, for the Rams. Um, Jared Goff had a solid game. Nothing, I mean, well, you know, he had an okay game. 20 for 31, uh, 275 yards, no touchdowns, and one interception. Um, the Rams, you know, we know the situation with their running attack. No more Todd Gurley. Um, they are usually using three backs now, Brown, Akers, and um, and uh, and Henderson. But uh, um, Brown got the majority of the snaps, 18 to t- uh, snaps or rushes for 79 yards and uh, two touchdowns. So with Brown being the, fe- the feature back, I think they're going to have some success uh, with that run game because they, you know, the overall scheme and the way that offensive line was playing today, they just they just look better. <laughs> That's the only thing I can say. They just look a lot better. They were moving the power forward, and it just looked a lot better uh, compared to last year. We know last year the, the offensive line was just garbage. It was just trash. And, I, you know, I think really kind of got the blame for it, but, you know, that's water under the bridge. Um so, like I said, that was a surprising win for the Rams. Uh, the Dallas Cowboys are going to have to go back to the drawing board. Um, the Rams, with their new uh, defensive coordinator, uh, the scheme wasn't too uh, complex, but it was enough to come, you know, confuse the Cowboys. The Cowboys didn't really uh, figure it out, and uh, look, they only came up with 17 points. So. Uh, so far so good for the Rams uh, We'll see what they do next week This is your boy AC LA Sports Live Like, comment, share, subscribe I really appreciate it It really helps the channel out I'll wrap with y'all later